In the f first example, uh, it made an example who's uh, an object whose two-string function triggers garbage collection, and then when the post decrement operator ran, uh, it was a dangling uh, something got garbage collected that still had references to it, and that created a dangling pointer situation, and that caused a bad crash. Uh, the second example um, is just an example of uh, nested statements that were necessary to cause a crash. And the third example um, is an example where uh, some state needed to accumulate. It had a setter and a watch point for the same variable name, and then triggered garbage collection, and that made something that made a simple statement crash. Uh, you can you can get this tool um, by uh, by going to Bugzilla and uh, typing in JS Funfuzz as the bug alias. We'll be putting together a permanent home um, for for these these tool for this tool and other ones we'll be releasing, but um, we wanted to make sure we didn't want to say oh we'll release it once we've got a great website for it because the tool is the is really the the meat of the operation here. So that's available now. Um, and we'll also be announcing further tools as they're available on the security blog, which is uh, available at that URL. So for information about Mozilla security, these are the, uh, the URLs that you, you want. The security blog is the, pl the best place to look for uh, ongoing announcements about security issues, uh, security tools, updates, any information that we're making available, um, and a couple of other projects that are available at uh, the URL at the bottom. There are a lot of different ways that you guys can get involved. This is the last thing we're going to say about this. Um, you can be an evangelist, work, uh, join Spread Firefox. You can give us feedback. You can develop add-ons and uh, implementations. You can be a contributor. You can run nightly builds. Um, and specifically, security folks can can do a lot in the uh, by participating in the design conversations, by um, developing tools, by identifying vulnerabilities, doing penetration testing, reporting them back to us. And we really appreciate all the work that you guys do that helps make Mozilla secure. So thank you. And thank you. Oh. Oh, you're too kind. You're too kind. <laughs>